Well, right now, a three-year-old boy with Down syndrome is staying with family after DCF says that he was left home alone. Yeah, the sheriff's office says a tip started this investigation. News Six's Lauren Korn talked to the family who is sticking by the woman accused of this. She's never been in trouble and uh, she's a good mom. Shirlene McLean defends her daughter, 39-year-old Shirlisa Hodge, after deputies say she left a three-year-old boy who has Down syndrome alone at home while she picked up her six-year-old daughter from school. I think it was an incident. I know that she would never do it intentionally. Uh, put her uh, children in jeopardy. Deputies say DCF acted on an anonymous tip, stating Hodge also left the boy alone in a dog cage. That is not true. Um, there's no cage. He had a child proof by law, a child proof fence across his door. McClellan shared these pictures showing a baby gate that's propped up in the toddler's room. Deputies reported there was a dog cage inside the house and a dog was in it. They are good parents with those kids. Rose Thomas also believes her neighbor should be back home instead of behind bars. They take very good care. They wouldn't abuse them in no kind of way. So I hope they really sell this and get her back over there. And she's a sickly woman. She in and out the hospital all the time. Hodge admitted to deputies that she left the child alone in his gated room for 15 minutes, but it wasn't an everyday thing. Find probable cause. The judge reducing a $5,000 bond to $2,500. Since Hodge does not have a criminal record, however, she's not allowed to have contact with the child. What she did is wrong, but it was not... I don't think her thought. I think, again, my family and myself is traumatized to where we're not focused. In DeLand, Lauren Korn, News 6. DCF says it is investigating and working with law enforcement. The kids are safe with family tonight.